Nothing would be worth it. You pay me enough. <laughs> okay, the Boca Raton Achievement Center. What a special place. It's a non-profit special education school for middle and high schoolers. They teach life skills for people 11 years old to 22 years old. Our TA walkers shine a light on their programs and some of their success stories. Yeah, so they have 100% academics, but then there's also vocational programs that they have. And I want to bring in Evelyn, who's the executive director. Come on in, Evelyn. And this is our hospitality uh, training area, right? Yes, this is where our students learn how to make beds, how to do laundry, um, sorting laundry, um, what gets folded, what gets hung up. Um, it's not just um, an employment skill, but it's also an independent living skill. Right, because they could use that in their everyday lives. Now, I never make my bed, but uh, I, I don't need to learn that. Okay, <laughs> so this is a, a grocery store area, right? Yes, yes. So the students will learn to face items on the shelves, check um, expiration dates. Um, they can organize, clean, and the skills that they learn here, we also will take them into the community so they'll do the same work in like a Publix or a Trader Joe's. That's awesome, so that they can earn some of their own money, which is important. Yes, our goal is to get them employed. I love that. Okay, let's go talk to the principal, Jennifer. Jennifer, this is a station you're really excited about. Yeah. Tell me about this one. So we have many job stations. They're all different um, career clusters, but this particular one is on um, the workshop where they can take things apart and put them back together. So there are small watches, um, small um, flashlights, uh, things that they can, um, different Lego sets that they can put together and take apart because it's really easy to differentiate for different levels. And then the one that I think is cool is <laughs> the banking area where they can learn to count back money and identify money. Yeah, that's another one, good one for differentiating skills too. It can be as difficult or as basic as it needs to be to meet the kids' school skill level. So they may be matching different dollar bills and amounts or they may be putting together full deposits and double checking that the cashier is right. Well, thank you. Uh, do we are we being called to the principal's office today? Oh, not if you're lucky. <laughs> okay, so Holly and Ashley, we're not being, we're not in trouble yet. <laughs> Woo, that was oh close. <laughs> you know what? This is such a special place. This is a school that literally wraps its arms around students that are often brushed aside by society once they graduate out. And they're saying, no, we're going to give you hands-on skills, training, oh. so you can go and live your best life. Yeah, and what they learn can take them all the way through life. T.A., great stuff. Thanks, T.A.